Hello, my name is Ardi and we are going to solve practice problem 10.8 from study book. Find the Tevenin equivalent at the terminus AB of the circuit of the figure 10.24. Okay, maybe let's just start right away and put the bottommost node here as our ground here. So the voltage here will be zero. But now we have this dangling resistor here that does not connect to everywhere. So that means that the voltage here at B will be also zero. So let's take note of that. VB will be zero. Now we need to find out V between A and B, right? Because that is an open circuit voltage. That, that is equal to the Thevenin voltage. Okay. But now we know that VB is zero. We just need to find out VA. How to find VA? Here. This is not A, okay? And if we take a look here, this is just a voltage divider, right? Okay, let's do voltage divider. Voltage divider. And the numerator will have this value here. That is minus J4. So I have minus J4. And for the denominator, we have the sum of all the inductance there so i will have minus j4 and then plus j2 and then plus 6 and all of them need to be multiplied by this one so i'll have 100 and the angle will be 20 degrees okay just put it into calculator so i will have this calculator set it up as complex number calculator and we'll have this so we'll have minus 4i divided by minus 4i plus 2i plus 6 and then multiplied by 100 and the angle will be 20 okay and let's convert this into polar so I'll have this one and I will have that. So I'll have 63.24. 63.24. And what is the angle? The angle will be minus 51.57. Okay. Minus 51.57 degrees. And the unit will be 4. Okay. And we know that VAB is V T H, so I will have V T H is just V A minus V B. But V B is zero, so I will have V T H is the same as V A. So I'll have 63.24 and angle of minus 51.57 degrees. The unit will be four. This is the Thevenin voltage. Okay, now let's find out the Thevenin resistance. And to do that, we need to take a look the, I mean, the resistance. Yeah, the resistance from this side here. But with this voltage source replaced by short circuit. Okay, that replaced by short circuit. Okay, now let's calculate the RTH. We can calculate the RTH by this is parallel with that, right? So I will have 6 plus J2 in parallel with minus J4. But then that will be parallel in series, sorry, with 10. Okay, so now let's just calculate that. For that parallel part, I will have 6 plus 2i multiplied by minus 4i divided by 6 plus 2i minus 4i and then plus 10.
Okay, and we will get 12.4. 12.4 plus J 3.2 A eh, minus J point two okay. minus J 3.2 okay minus J 3.2 and the unit the unit will be ohm so this is the Tevenin resistance yeah we can just draw the circuit with VTH and RTH but the value is this one and this one and i think that's all for this practice problem hopefully i did not make any mistakes in the calculation thank you for watching and bye bye